As mandated by the U.S. Constitution, our nation gets one chance each decade to count its population. To get an accurate count, the Census Bureau must have an accurate address list, maximize self-response, and follow up with those who don't respond. What a lot of people don't know is we've done the census in the United States since 1790, and it's actually mandated in the U.S. Constitution under Article 1, Section 2. Why is it important? Two main reasons. We use the population count to apportion representation in Congress. The second big reason is to find out where the population is, what um, services need to be funded, and return tax dollars that have come into the federal government back to those communities, to the people where they are. Census 2020 has begun, and Crabtree explains the timeline he's under. We will start conducting the actual count in February, and we will take it up through July. But after July, we have to take all those numbers, uh, tabulate them, uh, put them in a final report, submit them to the president by December 31st of 2020. The Census Bureau has three ways for you to complete your census form. One, we're sending out the form starting in mid-March. If you want to do it uh, without sending something through snail mail, there's going to be a link at the top of the form. And you can go on the website and you can do it that way and be done. And then the third way, you can call a phone number that will also be included with that information, go through a series of menus, and you're done. So what we're doing is hiring 500,000 people across the country, that's in every state, the District of Columbia, and all of our territories. In this county right now, uh, we need 2,000 census takers. You know, and uh, we want people to go on to 2020census.gov slash jobs and apply for those jobs. Um, they're, they're flexible. Um, they work with your schedule. You don't even have to quit your current job. There, there's two basic categories. One, we have those people who are going to work in uh, offices. That's more of your uh, traditional work day and traditional work week. And we have two locations here in Middle Tennessee where that's possible to do. One is uh, our Shelbyville uh, area census office, and the other one is our Nashville census office, which is actually in Franklin. Um, we also have field operations. I work in field operations myself. Um, field operations, they go out in the community. Now, when I say that, though, um, I don't want you to think that they're coming knocking on your door right away. They're not. Uh, what, what they are doing uh, initially is working on the area that we call group quarters. As we get into the self-response phase, um, and we are not getting all the returns, then they'll start going through the neighborhoods and looking for those addresses that have not submitted a return yet. For Rutherford County, our jobs will be paying up to $21 an hour. So we're, we're asking for people who are the best, you know, what they do, who are trustworthy, um, and who have that flexibility, uh, and we want to pay you the best that we can to help us get this done because it's important not only to you personally, um, but it's also important to our community to make sure that we capture what uh, growth is happening here in, in Murfreesboro and Rutherford County in general.